A small but effective network of former neo-Nazis in Germany is helping extremists who want to leave the far-right scene. Felix Beneckenstein says he lived and breathed white nationalism for years. I was somehow fascinated. I wanted to rid myself of a certain guilt one has because of Germany's history, and so I fell for historical revisionism, right up to denying the Holocaust, reversing responsibility for World War II, as well as the role of the Allied forces, and so on. But when fellow neo-Nazis attacked a friend, Beneckenstein began to question his views. It was a bitter awakening, and it is for everyone that I know and accompany these days. It was a rude awakening. You have an idea of what's wrong with the world and believe you've discovered hidden truths. Exit founder Bern Wagner, a former East German police detective, says the group has helped hundreds of neo-Nazis start a new life at a time when extreme nationalism is again on the rise in Europe. It does a lot better for people that they can talk about the old days, not like old warriors who have won battles, but about the mistakes they've made in their lives. Stefan Raschow was a rising neo-Nazi star. He left the far-right party in 2008, owns a cafe, and helps Syrian and Iraqi refugees adjust to a new way of life. This is what filled my hole and his motivation to do something for other people. When I'm here on Wednesdays and sit together with people who went through worse fate, I have the feeling I'm needed. I have a task. It is something that makes me happy. For Rochelle, the life of being a former neo-Nazi now means bonding with those he once disliked. Peter Banda, Associated Press.